Hello everyone, my name is Oad and welcome back to another video. Today I will try to break down some questions I've been asked about Operation Broken Fang. I think these questions are getting asked quite frequently, so hopefully this video will be relevant for you. And instead of having one long video, I decided it might be a good idea to break it down into a series of videos. If you still have anything you would like to ask me, please leave your question in the comment section. I will be sure to check that up as soon as possible. Now that this is all behind us, let's get after it. One of the most common questions I think people ask is when they should buy the Operation Pass and maybe even buy a few of those and stock them up. As some of you already know, Operation Broken Fang is based on 16 weeks, that every other week you have a different set of missions you can do to gain stars. By doing a quick calculation, you will find out that the Operation ends approximately one month before the scheduled time, which is in April. Therefore, it's a common belief that right before the operation ends, the pass will be sold at about 40% discount from its original price, and then you can just go ahead, buy it, and spend all your stars at once. Just to make things clear, there is a high likelihood of that happening again, just like it did all those past operations, and even majors. So first off, I haven't bought the operation pass just yet, simply because I don't see any benefit of doing that so early on. I heard that some people just want to be part of the excitement and hype, some people are interested to see the competitive game metrics, but other than that I just can't find any legitimate reason to pay more for it right now. I guess part of the early purchase is just about the excitement of some sort of gambling and trying your luck to get the most expensive items while there aren't many of those, but seriously, the odds for that are quite low, and I do think that's just an impulsive thing to do. Most of the time, wishful thinking isn't a great thing to have, and it always reminds me that one time I used to gamble, and lost almost everything. And in that emotional state, I just couldn't handle myself. I decided that this is it, it's time to go big. And I literally spent everything I had, which was like 8 CSGO shadow keys, with unboxing them. Spoiler alert, it didn't make me rich and I, as I wished it would, and for the rest of that day I felt like shit. The moral of the story is just because it's easier to obtain stars, doesn't mean you need to spend them brainlessly. If someone wants to share their reasons for buying the Operation Pass, please leave it in the comment section because I'm really curious to hear what you have to say. Personally, I'm going to wait for the discount and continue to do my weekly missions as usual. And also, I'm actually doing it with two different accounts. The other day, I heard something about two buddies that plan to do it with 150 accounts. I'm not sure if those dudes are still going after it, because damn, that sounds like a lot of time and money. Yet, it will still be probably worth it. Regards to the second part of this question, if you should stock them up or not, again, this is kind of thing that over time can truly work because this item is unique and you can't get it anymore, the same principles over and over again. But I just cannot stop thinking about the fact that this is a relatively expensive item, and this is just a collectible coin that you can barely see in game. It's just a super weird flex, and comparing that for an actual skin that you can purchase, it just seems like a stupid thing to do. Like, that's just a stupid thing to spend your money on. I don't know how else to explain it. However, that's just my own opinion and thought. Obviously, people have proven me wrong by buying all of those shattered web passes or even major tickets, and maybe they just turn it into a currency in the lack of keys, but I guess that some of them actually consume them. So ultimately, I think it will work itself out, but I'm not happy about it, I still think it's dumb. That's all for this video, thank you so much for watching, hope everyone will have a wonderful weekend, and I really appreciate you being around. Talk to you soon guys.